August of 2010, I was starting my first semester of college at Winona State University. I wasn't positive what I wanted to do with my life, but I knew I was going to do something in the medical field, and I knew I was going to play softball for a Division II college. I finally decided on a major before my second semester of my freshman year, Movement Science. I was going to become a physician's assistant or a physical therapist. After winter break of my sophomore year, I hurt my shoulder and could no longer play softball until it healed. During that time, I really started to examine what I really wanted to do with my life. At the time, if it was a realistic option, I would have just played softball for the rest of my life. However, it wasn't reality, and it took getting injured to recognize that fact. I knew that I enjoyed working with kids and had done so in the teacher position when I taught vacation Bible school. I also knew I loved working one-on-one -on -one with my little cousins and helping them learn new things. It was the second semester of my sophomore year that I decided I needed change and decided I was going to transfer to Concordia University, Wisconsin and major in Lutheran Elementary Education the following year. Once I began clinicals, I have never been more positive that this is what I want to do for the rest of my life. I chose Lutheran education because I was brought up in the faith and find it very important for children to have it in their education. I attended Lutheran schools from preschool until my senior year of high school. It is an environment that I am very familiar with and want each student I teach to be able to share with me. One of the champions in my life is my dad. He has helped form me into the person I am today in many ways. He is a Lutheran school teacher and principal, and I actually had him as a teacher in 7th and 8th grade. We didn't always see eye to eye, but he is my role model of the kind of teacher and person I hope I can one day be. Another one of my champions in my life is my mom. She is also a teacher. She went back to get her degree later in life after my brother and I were old enough. She has shown me in many ways what it truly means to never give up. She is one of the strongest people I know and truly touches every life she crosses paths with. I hope to one day be half of the person that she is. My last champion is my grandpa, who passed away a year ago now. His strong faith and devotion to God has truly influenced me in more ways than he ever knew. He told us how he tried his best to build his family on the rock and foundation of Christ and hoped that we would continue the same even after he was gone. It is because of my family that I am becoming a Lutheran elementary teacher. I may have my weaknesses, like procrastination and getting easily overwhelmed, but my strength is in my family, who is always there to support me. Therefore, everyone who hears these words of mine and puts them into practice is like a wise man who built his house on the rock. Matthew 7, verse 24.